this little guy. Welcome back. Today, we have an interesting video. Uh, maybe about a week ago, I went to uh, a house, this old lady's house. She had a blue, a teal uh, toilet. She wanted it out because she was remodeling the bathroom and all this. I took the toilet out and when I looked inside the tank, and I'm gonna show you what we have inside this tank. But anyways, when I opened the tank, this is what I found. It's, 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 not, it's close to this one. By the way, this is a, um, uh, a, uh, what's the name of the, the old box. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this is a family show. So here you go. This is what this is. We might have to blur it. Yeah, we might have to bleh, get rid of that anyways, but it's pretty cool. Check that out. All right. So this is an old fashioned toilet shut off valve. By the way, this is another funny story. The mailman dropped this off and look this, when I saw it in the picture, it was all, it's brand new. They still make the, all, they still make this stuff. Look at the dents on this thing. Look at all the dents that the mailman just, it just threw it in front of my door. Um, and I heard it. I was actually here when he dropped this off. And uh, I contacted uh, eBay and, and the person that sold this to me, I, sh I took all the pictures and showed it to them. They decided to uh, refund me the money and not even talk to me, so I don't know. Anyways, I got this one for free. I paid for it, but then I got my money back. Let's look in here. By the way, 37 subscribers. Look how many rolls of toilet paper I could, I, now I could go. <laughs> <laughs> now I have. Now I have. Check this out. Let's open this up. This is like, I've changed this maybe, I've changed this plastic piece uh, every couple, you know, every two years or something. The toilet that I took this thing out of, it's been, it's been working for years and years and years. So she actually got rid of the toilet because she's changing the color of the bathroom. So. Um, and what she got was a plastic one, so she's not going to be happy with that. But anyways, uh, this is what's happening here. I have it turned off because it just continues to run. And I replace these maybe once every two years or so. So I'm going to put on this video and see how long it takes for that thing over there um, to, uh, to break or to not work. So let's go ahead and take this out and put this thing in because this is going to be pretty cool. And by the way, this is what it does. You turn the water on, you flush. I'm not going to flush too much. But anyways, doesn't e and then it doesn't even fill. And then eventually, and then eventually it starts to fill. And then when it gets to here, it just continues to fill. It doesn't do anything. So anyways, let's shut it off and see how simple, and we're not gonna use any tools, I, I think. Uh, maybe we have to use a little tool for that. But anyways, let's flush this, get rid of all the water. I'm gonna keep the, the, the uh, flush valve, so that way, because it does save on a lot of water. I'm just changing the fill valve. So, I don't know, this is not very old. old. So, I'm gonna use, a little bucket, I'm gonna put it under here and to catch all the water that's gonna come out of here. So let's shut this off, shut that off and uh, get rid of all the water, get rid of that. It's a simple fix that anybody can do. This is it's pretty quick to, to do. So you all you're pretty much doing here and is removing the water. That's pretty intense. Okay. And you know what? I'm gonna have to get a tool. I'm just gonna get a wrench. A pair a pair of pliers like this. Huh. And the reason, well, the plastic parts you can take off with uh, your hand, but I have a, a, a one of these toilet seats and it's, it's got a couple of different valves under here, so we do need just to loosen them up.
Okay, that's the end of that. And you know, these are not it's still leaking out. Oh god, I got my knee wet. These are just plastic, you know, is they don't plastic it's plastic never works out. Anyway, so here we go. So we got this little guy, isn't she a beauty? That's cool. It's beautiful. Not a, not everybody appreciates um copper. The, the, the copper and the workings of a toilet, but anyways, there we go. We put this in. So now we're gonna take the uh Mailman's soccer ball. We're gonna install it in here. By the way, they sell these in plastic. I got this one because it's you know it, it goes with the uh, with the look. But the plastic ones will last for a long, long time. My grandmother had plastic ones. And so I'm gonna take this, and you can shape these wherever you want. So I'm gonna bend it a little bit. This is a solid bar. You know you can bend them. This this is just a solid bar, and uh, you know you don't you don't want to they they break. I mean, this this metal is pretty, brass is pretty malleable, but it will break if you if you go too far. Which all we want is to keep it away from the uh, from the walls. So we're gonna just bend it a little bit, put this thing in, and once it's in here, I can tweak it a little bit. Man, I'm disappointed it's got all these dents. Even though nobody's gonna ever see this. But. But you know it's there. But I know it's there. All right, so I think that's good. So now we're gonna do the same. If we're gonna put it all back. We're gonna go in reverse. We're gonna put the valve in first. What's this piece? Um. Okay. <laughs> I'll tell you what this piece is. It's not used. We can't use it. But this, this, this comes a lot of the now. A lot of your plumbing, um, it's, it's got like those uh, plastic tubing. So you can bring the plastic tubing from the wall right into here. And uh, it's got like a, at the end, it's a, uh, a flared end or a, uh, it's a compress some kind of compression uh, seal that this makes on here. So they give you this part, you put your little tube through here and it's got a little ball at the end and then this is what attaches to your to your brass so um, but in this case it's not going to be used because we already have all the terminated uh, uh, hoses so we don't need it so we'll skip that that's we'll leave that out see ev everything is uh, already here so and it, it, it's all the, all these all these fittings all these things are all the same. They're all a standard. I think this is like three quarter or something, but it's, it's all standard. So it it should every everything should fit. All right, that is so cool. All right, very cool. All right. Um, so we'll put uh, this guy goes right here. Okay, so this has to turn. And if we did everything correct, we should have no leaks. See what happens. Oh, okay, I forgot that we have another. I thought we had another part. Huh. Um. Huh. This, this needs to, okay, well, anyways. All right, so we're filling. I gotta put a little, I thought it did. I must have taken it out or it fell out or something, but it, there's a little hose here that fills the, like the ones that we had, it fills the inside. So now, okay, so this is the little piece that I was talking about, which I have it, but it, I bought this. This is another one. These are, these are called Manfield, by the way. And uh, you know, that's a little, uh, this one, I think it's a little newer. This one's a little older. But look at this little guy. It's got, you know. So I bought two because you know, this is the secret in government spending. Why buy one when you can get two for twice the price? <laughs> okay, so I do have this thing. So you put it in here and all the parts are 
they kind of interchange, I think. Let's see. Kind of interchange. Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. Sometimes this is what you got to deal with when you buy um, these kind of old stock uh, from eBay or whatever. All right, so that's how it's supposed to go. It, it fills this. I'm gonna get a different uh, a different little hose because I want to save this one for the for the one I have there. But anyways, so let's turn it on now. It should pretty much fill the thing. And then it's got adjustments. And how do you do the adjustments? You uh, bent your uh, your rod. So now it should come up and stop. And it. Okay, so let's see if it come up. Beautiful. So that's how that works. But it's a little high, so what I'm going to do, here's the adjustment. It's a, it's a real scientific kind of adjustment for this. So you take it, and you bend it. And you bend it. You flush. Then you turn this a little bit. Because you want this. Okay. So there it is. Let's make sure it'll come up to the. All right. So it's still a little tight up against this. So what I'm going to do again is uh, I'm a. Maybe I should take it off to bend it. I don't want to mess it up. Maybe I'll take this off to bend it. This one, I'm going to bend this one first this way. And then I'm going to bend the end without messing up the threads. Uh, a little bit this way. And that should be enough. Like that. Oh, that is so cool. All right. So there it is. So let's hope that it doesn't fill too high. If not, we'll, we'll tweak it down a little bit. See, I don't like it that it's moving over the thing. But, see, it's grabbing. All right, so um, we're not gonna put the hose in because uh, it doesn't really go with this one. You know, this little guy doesn't really go. So um, it looks pretty good, so we're gonna flush it. Whoa! <laughs> okay, okay, hold on. So I don't want it. Okay, I don't want it so so high. So I'm gonna. <laughs> Wasn't this supposed to be simple? <laughs> it is a simple. It is a simple fix. But what? Why? There we go. Oh, okay. There we go. There it is. Beautiful. It needs the little hose. I I know I had it, but but I'm gonna. I'll find it. I'll, I'll get something for there. But there it is. Pretty much all set. So let me block this now so that we won't get another splash. Wow, it shoots pretty good. We don't want the water to spew and I want to show everybody how, how good this thing is. So I'm going to put this back in here. All right, I hope I don't get splashed. Ready? Wow, I like it. And now I bet that this, this will outlast me. There it is. Beautiful. You know, the, the, the whole thing in here, the only thing that's, that it's a, it's a part that would fail in this type of thing is the, there's a rubber piece under here. That's the only thing that, everything else is metal. You know, everything else is metal, so. And by the way, copper sanitizes the water, so that's kind of a good thing. Anyways, all right, well, that's a wrap for this one. <laughs> and uh, please like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, we'll, we'll bring you some more videos. Thank you. Bye. Bye.